It started out as what everyone thought was a simple cold. Months later, Alex Lewis would be missing part of his face, along with both arms and both legs. It was all the doctors could do to keep the man from literally being eaten alive. Had they not taken such drastic steps, there would only be a cautionary tale to tell. Alex did indeed have a cold, but it was more than that. Tests would later reveal that he had contracted a viral case of Group A streptococcus. Now this is nothing unusual. It happens, and the body typically filters it out. But in this case, the condition worsened. It became septicemia, blood poisoning, and then turned into toxic shock syndrome. Alex was in a coma as his vital organs shut down one by one. A week later, doctors saw the telltale signs that the infection was raging out of control in the man's feet, fingertips, arms, lips, nose, and part of his ears were turning black, an indication of dead tissue. An emergency amputation saved his life, but there was more misery to come. The toll taken on Alex was severe. Physically, he's endured several surgeries to stabilize his body and fix his face, but the psychological pain was equally bad. Alex's baby son found his father's face frightening, and there were times when he wouldn't hug or kiss his dad. Over time, that has changed, but there are still many challenges ahead. Despite all the emotional and physical challenges Alex has been through, he continues to thank God every day for his life. He is a fighter. This is Nikki Delgado for nollygrio.com.